Brahma, Vishnu and Shiva contemplated, they are bound in the three qualities, so salvation remains far from them. For the Guru Vard, this is the knowledge that he knows only one Lord and night and day utter his name. One reads the Vedas but realizes not God's name. Involved in Mammon, his reading and reciting leads to pearls. Within the ignorant and blind man is the filth of sin. How can he swim across the impassable world ocean? He expounds all the controversial points in the Vedas, but his heart is not saturated with devotion, nor he realizes the name. The Vedas tell of all the virtues and vices, but it is by Guru's guidance alone that the name nectar is quaffed. He, the unique true Lord, is all by himself. Without him, there is not any other. Nanak says, true is the mind of him who is imbued with the name and he tells nothing but truth. Maru, third guru, the true Lord has established his true throne. He abides in his own home where there is no worldly attachment and mammon. When the truth abides in the heart eternally, then by guru's guidance man's actions are ennobled. True is his merchandise and true his trade. There is no illusion nor any other ostentation. He has earned the truth.